Parawatu started with the intention to honor and safeguard indigenous peoples, cultures, and holders of ancient wisdom traditions. There had to be a way to conserve precious ways of life and environments while developing economies and societies in East Africa. For over 20 years, Tarawatu has been working with communities in northern Tanzania to build classrooms, computer labs, integrative medicine clinics, medicinal plant gardens, and handicraft businesses, all while marrying indigenous wisdom with modern technology. We harness know-how and skills from visitors from around the world, sharing ideas, current realities, and finding bridges between distant lands and hearts. When you get the technology, they can see what the world is doing, what they need to do for themselves, and what they need to change for themselves. In recent years, we have partnered with orphan centers to help improve food security, nutrition, and health. We've started cooking classes that build on local ingredients combined in more nutritious ways. Tarawatu is a leading NGO in the Arusha region of Tanzania, both hosting and participating in annual events like International Women's Day and the Day of the African Child. In 2021, we celebrated 20 years of success. In 2021, we also lost our dear friend and board member Lynn Brett Snyder. A gifted healer and environmentalist, Lynn was a member of the Coconut Grove Women's Club of Florida. She was deeply committed to empowering women and girls all over the world and was a true champion of Mother Earth. For years, Tarawatu's women's network of Mokono Village have been asking us for a place where they can produce their handicrafts in a clean space process the moringa they've been growing, and have a gathering place for women and children to learn from each other. During the COVID pandemic, Tarawatu leased land to initiate a permaculture demonstration farm with the intention to help villagers feed their families during a time of rising food insecurity and climate changes. With initial infusion of funds from the estate of Lynn Brett Snyder, Tarawatu has begun construction of a women's center adjacent to the permaculture farm. The whole community got involved in the beginning stages of construction, helping to build the foundation. The walls are now up and the roof is on. Now we need to complete the interior, the facade, install electricity, and source locally made furniture. The Lynn Brett Snyder Women's Center will serve thousands of in the years to come potentially become a sister club to other women's clubs and be a legacy to our dear friend. So to have this center will make us to meet with more than 200 to 250 women at once. So we'll make our work so easy on women empowering and small business development. So I wish every woman to do something for the center, for the Maasai women. Thank you very much. And I hope you're going to open your hands for it. We appreciate it if you can finish this foundation for Lean Memorials. It would be good. So thank you very much and God bless you all, all of you for this fundraising. Thank you very much. Yeah.